What is going on guys? Hey, it's your boy Manny B here with the Skinny Water Boys. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. I am here with my main man Travis Polk from Team Money Lures. We are in his workshop right now. He is pouring baits for tomorrow's trip on the lake. Alright guys, I'm gonna be a fly on the wall and just watch over his shoulder and just see how he does this because dude, I've always wanted to see it firsthand, so let's check it out. June bug. I got Jeez. just about every color you can do. The last cover was a little silver gray. Let's do some like watermelon. Maybe with like the base of like some pearl. Like a white oh. pearl on the bottom. And then maybe some red flake in there with oh, that. Yeah. A little bit of that, sh that shimmy shim right there. Oh. Yeah, it's all clear now. Damn, you are in plane. <laughs> a little bit or a lot? You like a lot of flake or? Uh, you want texture or you want a lot of flake? That's a lot of flake. <laughs> do a little bit more and then see what it looks yeah. like. Yeah, like right there. Does that mean it's going to get a lot of flake? I'm going to add this yeah. one. Add some red. Mmm. Yeesh. And that gray in there too. Mm -hmm. Cheat gun. We got 297, 287. We'll give it just a touch. Let's trim this one up. Oh, there's a lot of glitter in these brown ones too. Or green ones. Almost can barely tell them apart actually. I know, right? Alright guys, there you have it. Travis poured these baits. They look money. So, let's check it out tomorrow morning and see what we catch with it. Appreciate you guys watching. See y'all on the water. What is going on guys? Hey, we are on the water now. Look at that. A freaking gator. I don't know if y'all can see on the GoPro. There's a gator right there. Probably a 10 footer. What did you say Travis? Oh yeah. Easily 10 foot. Yes sir. But yeah guys, we are paddling to the spot that we want to fish first thing this morning. And we are we were the first people here at the boat ramp. So we're like probably got another 50 yards to go. And then we're gonna be at the spot. We're gonna test out Travis's lures that we that he poured last night. Bro, those things look money. Where are they at? Here we are. Look at that. Sheesh. Yes, yeah, sir guys. I got a frog on, uh moving bait and a jig. I'm gonna take the jig off and uh Put on one of Travis's baits. So stay tuned, guys. But the gator is like circling us, I think, right now. Let's get on the water. Or let's get go fishing. Come on. Come on, baby. All right, boys. Check it out. I put Travis's T Money bait on a flashy swimmer. I believe it's a six or seven on. Uh, three eighths ounce, bro. That looks money. Water's kind of murky, you can't really see it, but take my word for it. It looks good. Right there. Oof. That gator crossed. He was summer. I don't know where he went, but I think we're good for now. Travis is changing out his jig real quick, and then we're gonna get moving. I'm good. Man, guys, look at that. There's so many different bird species here. So this lake uh, or river section is, I mean the whole lake, yeah, there's like a migratory bird stop for all species. And then to the coast down that way, freaking, we're, it's a good stopping point. Feels like we're in the jungle, the Amazon. The water is extremely low. Last, the water time was like right there, probably at the roots, maybe a little bit, a foot into the roots. So we'll see, we'll have to just to that the water was clear clear last time but with water changing fluctuation 
clarity changes. I mean, it's not a problem though. As you can see, there's a ton of bait. Look at that. Definitely fish this point going in. You guys, I'll take the left. You good with that? I'm cool with that. The only down bummer today is it was like 55 this morning, guys. That's why I'm wearing this same uh, sweatshirt right now. Keep me warm. Let's see how far we can go back. It's looking pretty narrow. Dude, there's a million ducks. All right, guys, I'm using this 7-Eleven. Oh, actually. I guess I'm using a 710 Heavy Suppressor Series by Old 18. 50 pound braid, Corrado 200 with a popping perch by KVD. Let's see if we can bring Mama home. Ooh! There we go, Travis. First blood of the day. Did that hit that instantly? Let's go, little guy, but hey, breaking the ice in, right? Dude, that rod yanked him out, dude. Oh. <laughs> dude, that thing Egg freaking crush. Dude, he hit that hard, bro. <laughs> that startled me. Oh, that was a bass. I waited, reeled, found him. God, how did I not hook that, dude? Finally. Mm-hmm. There we go, boys. See all the bait up there? Dude, he was just like, that was probably big. That was probably a giant. That was a silent. Oh. Maybe not. That's just so cool. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but usually a silent slurp is a big fish. <laughs> Got him on the swimmer. Yes, sir. Hell yeah, boys. We poured Travis poured these last night. Catching fish today. Hmm. Sheesh. Look at this place, guys. Look at this place full of freaking stumps. Maybe a jig would be better than this. 
Uh, I'll try to swarm for a little bit and then the flashy swimmer, see what happens. It's pretty freaking shallow. Oh! <laughs> yes, sir. Guess we'll flip him, flipping and pitching, dude. Look, he, that little guy ate this 12 inch worm. Dude, dumped it, Travis. Why am I? Oh. oh there we go. <laughs> hey, he wasn't coming up though. Dude, we just take our time. We'll, we'll stumble across a good one. That's a nice one. Yes, sir. Hey. See you later, bud. One. There we go, little guy. Damn, took my claw off. GoPro, stop recording. Travis and I have been ripping them left and right. But the GoPro overheated, so I had to take it off. Let it cool down for a little bit. See how long I can... It's like 90. It's supposed to get reached to 90 today. So it gets pretty dang hot. And I found a little pattern. Oh! Oh, there we go, Travis. Yes, sir. Oh, get it in, Travis. Get it in. Oh, oh. That's a nice one. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Dude, that's a fucking good one. Oh <laughs> I knew there was a nice one in here, bro. Dude, this is a tank. Oh my god. This might be close to a PB, dude. Oh my gosh, that's a toad, bro. Dude. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh, here, I'll get my scale out, dude. That is freaking sick. Zeroed out, boys. Okay. Off that one right there, or what? Yep. Oh, it's not a. Oh, six eight one. Six eight one. That's still Damn. a freaking tank, dude. Tank. Let's go. Tank. Let's go, baby. After flipping a million timbers, I knew they had a toad back here. Hey, so let me get my camera out. There we go, boys. Six eight. 22 and a quarter. 22 and a quarter, mouth closed. Yep. Hell yeah, Travis. Yep. Baby, we're gonna let her go. One last look at her. Let's go, Travis. Ooh. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, that's a big one. Look, he's got a bowfish on the bow in it. Uh-uh. He's got an arrow in it. Damn. Oh, it's all the orange tip. Oh. 
No wonder those guys are throwing that stuff up. Little Cinco's back here. There's a lot of. <laughs> On the bait. Not bad. All right, guys, what a freaking day on the water with Travis right here. Oh my gosh, we caught a ton of bass left and right. Uh, well, actually not really left and right, but first, I guess started off kind of slow in the morning and then we found this little back slough kind of deal. It was like super shallow. It was like one way looked really gross and this water did not look healthy at all. And then uh, we, Travis pointed out a little little uh, back cut I was like let's try it and because the other side looked good but the one way we tried was it's too shallow and then it was just littered with tons and tons of stumps and stickums you name it and then boom I flipped the 12 inch worm caught that nice one so it was awesome and then the day just started turning around right there and then next thing you know out of nowhere Travis as y'all saw got stuck that tank it was freaking awesome and then towards the end of the day uh, I started catching uh, you know here and there on the T-Money lure with a billy with like the flashy swimmer so that was pretty dope but overall the day was great seeing the alligators sharing the waters with them and the seeing like that giant freaking uh, seven foot alligator gar that was insane I wish I could catch that thing uh, maybe one day I'll catch one but guys thank y'all so much for watching if you want to see more videos of me fishing this lake let me know in the comments below and I'll see y'all next episode with Manny B the Skinny Water Boys